Welcome to the Titan Tar channel. Today we have a topic to discuss about Ukraine breaking one of the biggest limits of the atomic age. Don't miss the chance to join us and share your opinions with us. Become a member of our channel and evolve your rank. The American press notes that Volodymyr Zelensky, leader of the Kiev regime, by ordering the invasion of the Ukrainian armed forces in the Korsk region, appears to be risking everything. His intention, according to these sources, would be to provoke an escalation that would lead to a nuclear conflict, amid what many interpret as a desperate attempt in the face of his imminent defeat in the conflict with Russia. This move, described as a bold gamble, reflects the gravity of the situation faced by Zelensky and his government, whose position has been constantly weakened by Russian advances. According to an influential American newspaper, the Ukrainian incursion into Russian territory represents the breaking of one of the greatest taboos of the nuclear age. This is the first time in history that a nation without nuclear weapons has invaded the territory of a nuclear power and occupied part of its territory. The unprecedented feat puts the world on alert, as the invasion of an atomic superpower could result in unpredictable consequences, shaking the already fragile global geopolitical stability. However, what remains uncertain, according to the authors of the article, is the response of the Biden administration and other Western allies of Kiev. The question remains whether they will try to contain Zelensky, fearing the unfolding of a catastrophic scenario involving the use of nuclear weapons, or whether they will continue to increase support for Ukrainian actions in the hope that Moscow will not resort to nuclear weapons. This ambiguity regarding future Western measures reflects the complexity of the moment in which the decisions made can determine the course of the conflict and global security. The paper also suggests that the West still harbors the illusion that Vladimir Putin is willing to negotiate peace, even with the possibility of Ukraine joining NATO and the European Union. The authors point out that the Biden administration has lost control over Zelensky's actions, which have disregarded advice from Washington. Given this, the next U.S. president will likely be forced to adopt new policies to deal with the escalating Ukrainian crisis, a challenge that Biden has failed to address. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like the video, and share it with your friends. Your interactions mean a lot to us and help us grow. See you next time.